Hey, what up, fellas? It's finally time to go on a little road trip, and I'm pretty freaking excited. We got a new pair of waders over there, so hopefully when we're done, we don't have a half count of water in our waders, but we are going to be fishing a totally new body of water, and what we're definitely going to do is we're going to learn, and I just want the knowledge, man. Give me all the knowledge. We still got a little way to go, so let's get out there before sun sets. I'm seeing water, boys. I'm seeing some water. That means we're here. All right, here's what we're looking at. We're out here kind of midday. We have our lures, which we're probably gonna chuck right now, but more towards the end as well. But we also have the good old aquarium full of some live shrimp. So we have the chance of running into some black drum, some redfish, and also sheep's head. And if we can catch them, I'll take them. And hopefully, as it gets later today, whoosh, this guy takes over. It might do good right now though. All right, let's get them, let's go get them. Let's make it feel what we wanna be And work it out successfully Cause you know Ain't hard to know I've got a feeling that I've had before Here's the lure we're going with. They got a quarter ounce jig head. We are fishing a little bit deeper. And we have the down south supermodel chicken on the chain color. There's a guy. Oh, that's, that's a fish, dude. Let's go. Trout. 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 He's coming in. It's not a super dink, at least. Dang, he's... Feisty. Look at he gobbled it. That's not a bad one. Not big, but not bad, dude. Ooh, he's thick. A little chonker. <laughs> Holy cow. Look at that, dude. Look at his back. Not a very big guy, but he's got some meat on his bones. Bang. Ooh. So we're gonna get that guy back. Just you know, that was I released him like that on purpose, alright? <laughs> but we I did want to get him back so we can get right back in here because we are drifting. Dude, if I could wade right here, I think, my guess is, I haven't checked, but I think we're in about three or four feet of water. I wish I could hop out, but I don't think we can. Oh wow, we're pretty deep. We're like five feet. There's a guy. Wow. There is a guy. Looks like he had some chasing him too. Woo, another fat boy, man. Same size about. I would like to catch bigger, at least longer. If there's if we catch a big one, if we catch a long one, and he's as fat as these guys, that'd be a nice fish. Oh, my bad, fella. Golly, they're hard to hold on to. They're so thick. Both of those fish gobbled the bait, too. I said it pretty much right away, and they already had it pretty deep in their mouths. So they definitely want to eat. Hmm. Classic. Who doesn't like a little bit of motor troubles when you're in new waters? I'm actually gonna drift this shrimp behind the boat on the popping cork. It might get bit, but also if we see some black drum, like I have been seeing, I have been seeing some black drum, we can reel it in and cast at the, at the drum with the shrimp. Bang, it might get bit right there even, you never know. What we just did too is we whipped back around where we were drifting previously, where we got those bites and also where we saw a nice slick come out of. So hopefully we'll be able to run into the fish that made it. Oh, there's a fish on the shrimp, dude. We're popping the shrimp out there. It's a trout. Might be a decent one too. I was about to leave. I, I was about to reset the drift. Oh wow, this might be a decent trout, dude. I was about to reset the drift, but I figured we might as well use the shrimp up. Oh my gosh, this is a nice fish, man. A nice one. Holy cow, that's a nice fish. Oh my god. Not a giant, but dude, solid. Let's see if he's a fat boy like the other ones. Bang. Dang, not bad, not bad, not bad. He is thick. Man, nice, nice solid one. See if he runs four pounds. Just about four pounds. 
Ooh. Man, look at that. <laughs> uh, I kind of hate that we caught him on the shrimp, but shoot, I'm happy to catch him any way I can. Nice little almost four pounder right there. Happy to catch him. We are fishing, like, we pass up the structure so quick, so we're only able to get one or two bites. I want to see if there's a way maybe we can... I wish I had a... If we had a power pole, that'd be the best. See a big man? Woo! He wanted that shrimp, huh? Dude, sometimes... You hate to see it. You hate to see it. You hate to know it that the popping cork with a live shrimp can catch him with the best of them. What we did find out, though, is that there are some bigger fish in the area, so we're going to keep fishing this spot and try and find even bigger than that four pounder. Sheesh. It's mm, bad, huh? Pretty bad. That was my rod, dude. Holy. What? That's fine. Yeah, I didn't need that anyway. Dang, did you guys? <laughs> did, you, <laughs> did you guys see all that? I knocked one of my rods off the side in a split second. And I barely even realized before it was too late. As long as we can catch some more fish, I'm not too mad about it. Who's got the feeling made me feel the best? The one where I forget all the rest, cause you know. We just need to catch it. 25 plus and then we'll be really happy. I don't think that's him. But what we do know is they are loving the shrimp, my man. They are loving the shrimp. I'll tell you what. That's another nice one. Why is the shrimp catching us the bigger ones? Not a big guy. Jeez, that's a handful though. I can tell before even grabbing him, bro. Dang. It's so thick. Jeez, that's how they kind of... Look at that fatty, fatty dude. I'm trying to get it over the side as quietly as possible. Oh my gosh, dude. This is, a, this is a decent one too. Dude, we're on some freaking fish, man. My gosh. Oh, it's a dinker though. I thought it was a better one. Why does he feel decent? Maybe because he, he, he's, I don't know, maybe because he's fat. Let's see. No, he's skinny boy. Still felt decent. That's the first skinnier one we've caught. Another interesting thing is we're using the popping cork. It's about six feet deep. So they're either, you know, in the mid water column or they're super willing to come up and get it. Oh, wow, there's a freaking fish on, dude. If I'm not mistaken. Is there? Is there a fish on here? There is. I. What? Is this something? Either. This is something big. Oh my god, dude. Maybe not, maybe not. What is it, dude? I I put the rod down. I just let it hang out there. And I was checking my phone. Seeing, seeing exactly where we, where we are, but we hooked up on something big. I'm pretty sure there's something big. This is digging, so I might be. Let's see, what is it, what is it, what is it? What is it, what is it? Drum, black drum, let's go! <laughs> see, this is why we brought the shrimps. That's why we brought the shrimps right there. It's crazy, man. This fishery is insane. I've seen so many, I've, I've seen probably, like, I've seen a bunch of, bunch of drum already today. And then we caught one. And then there's big trout. What else do you want? Bang! Not a bad one. Woo <laughs> Look at that guy. Check it out. He's pretty, he's not, usually these size, they still have uh, stripes, but I was gonna release this guy, but he is bleeding pretty good. So I don't mind keeping him at all. I was gonna keep some anyway, but I kind of wanted to keep fishing. Eh, so maybe not such a bad deal. We, we're keeping him. We, we got our stringer too. But uh, that's my fault. I, I turned around and I, like I said earlier, these fish are, they're eating it down. So I should have not just let my, uh, my popping cork hang out. I should have been watching it. Luckily, it's a black drum that we will be happy to keep. I've been talking about shrimp this whole time. Normally I wouldn't even bring it, 
I just had it from a trip yesterday and I just kept it. And it's kind of paying off. It's kind of paying off. Oh, we got hit. Oh my gosh. I think that, uh, it feels like a trout. Same area. Not a giant, not the big guy. Not the 34 incher yet. We'll get him though. We'll get him, don't you worry, we will get him. Dang, <laughs> that noise right there. That's the noise you're gonna hear a lot on the bay. Everyone's fishing, popping corks with a trout shaking it. Bang. Oh, don't get. Oh. Dang, fella. Here's what we're switching to. Good old fashioned, simple kale hook. These hook fish really, really well. They, it's very hard for them to shake it. I like using them for pretty much any bait. One thing I don't like them for is when you're throwing like bigger cut bait. It only has this smaller shank right here that's exposed. So if you have a big bait on it, it's not gonna give that much grip. Oh, is this a fish? My gosh, this drag is not doing what I want it to do. But this might be a decent fish, still. This might be a drum even. Might be a big trout though. Or a red. No, it's a trout. Another nice one, man. Wow. Woohoo. Look at that. Per damn, look how, look at these awesome spots, dude. That's so cool. Check it out. It's a leopard trout. He's got the leopard spots. Guys. That drag is something else, huh? <laughs> well, this is a nice fish, though. That's a good one. Woo! That is pretty decent, dude. Look at that handful right there. Let's try it, 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 let's try it. Hopefully, it's just, there's not a hole right here. Woo! We're testing the waders out. That'll do. We gotta catch at least one guy on the wade. There's a fish. Little guy, little guy. Dang, that's why you wade, boys, for the big ones. All right, we're doing something crazy here, but stick with me. We've got the DOA shrimp on a jig head. Let's see if we can catch anything on this. Oh, that's a fish. Thought we were caught up on that reef. Man, another. <laughs> Look at that, dude. Look how f tall he is. That's not a normal looking trout, dude. That's a trout that's going to be 30 inches and be a 10 pounder. Little football trout. It's time, ladies and gentlemen. It's time for the corkster to come out. Something is going for it, but. There, he finally got it, my gosh. He's staying down, but wait a minute. This might be something of a fish. He's staying down, that's real weird, weird huh? Ah, dang it, he's hooked him on the side again. Whoa, he's, a, he's not a super LG though, just a normal one. Come here, belly. Belly? Come here, fella. Yeah, that's what happens with the corksters. Whoa, whoa. Man, I, I, I can't get over, man, how fat these fish are. It's so cool. Wow, look at that, dude. Normally for a fish, I could close my hand on an easy peasy for a fish this length. But this guy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Almost makes you want to take them home, flay them up, because they're going to have some thicker flays, but we will definitely be letting this fella go. Boys, that might be crazy, but I think we just caught... Oh, dang, dude. Wow, it's not a bad fish. I had I had two fish on the same corky, and I lost the other one. That's not a bad one, though. Wow, they're both like this size. My gosh. I swear I had two fish on the corkster. Man, I thought I had a giant on. That's, that's a nice fish, even, but... I had two guys. Huh, that's crazy. There, 
Oh, wait. This is a weird feeling, fella. Hold on, fellas. <gasps> I thought it was a giant. It's a decent one, I think, though. Why does he feel so giant, actual? He is just fat, I'm pretty sure. She, look at this freaking football. Oh my God, dude. Holy cow. Look at how much meat this guy has on him. Whew, didn't get to hold it up. But. Man, I really want to stay in fish, but I can't. I gotta go. So we didn't really get into any of the big guys, but man, I was I was super happy just to get into a good, a really good number of trout. Nothing too big, but man, it's it's just great to have an area where there's a ton, a ton of speckled trout still to be caught. But here's the thing: we're still going after the big one, and we're gonna be going again tomorrow. I love you guys very much. I'll talk to you guys next time. Nothing, 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 nothing. <laughs>